We're here with Jack Nicholas. You are Jack Nicholas, aren't you? I am Jack Nicholas. Okay, great. <laughs> great to see you. We're here in Michigan, Benton Harbor. Great new facility here, Harbor Shores. Really dramatic with the with the lake holes now, the three new holes on the dunes. Talk about those holes and what a difference it's going to make to the rest of this layout. Well, I think the, the golf course is, sort of starts inland, goes out to the dunes, comes off of the dunes, has uh, some things on, on, the, on a couple of the rivers, and, you know, it's got... Uh, it's had more things than you can imagine. I mean, this 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 golf course started out playing through factories and, and toxic waste areas and super fun things and I mean uh, a whole bunch of things. But the golf course has turned out fantastic. I'm really pleased with it. It's it's aesthetically it's uh, it's it's very pleasing to the eye. It's uh, it plays nicely. It's uh, it's going to be a nice challenge. It's not going to be extremely long. It's a little over 7,000 yards in the back. You know, 64, 500 yards from the from the members tees. It's. Uh, it's got nice movement to it, it's, but it's, 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 a, it's a really, really, really trying to be a pretty nice golf course. Now you're still a young man, 69 years old, but you're still chasing it as far as designing golf courses all over the world. Why, aren't you, why, why are you not slowing down and just hanging out in Florida and spending time with the grandkids and chilling out? I can't afford it. i got to work. You know, everybody's got to work for a living. <laughs> you know, they, uh, but uh, no, I, I enjoy it. If I, if I decided to quit, it would be, you know, they may as well put me underground. I just I enjoy doing what I'm doing and I enjoy the traveling. I just got back from South Africa a couple of days ago. I was in China two weeks ago, and, uh, you know, I, I move around. But uh, the... Uh, the work here is fun. It's, uh, it's going to be, as I say, a really nice golf course. You really asked me, the first question you asked me was about the, the dunes, and I didn't really answer your question. But, but we played the seventh, eighth, and ninth holes play you know, on and off the dunes, and they really have turned out pretty nice. The seventh hole is a strong golf hole playing down, then up into the dunes, and the eighth plays off the, off the dunes down into a low area, which then we've extended the dunes out into the low area, so it looks like you're playing inside the dunes, and then back about halfway in the dunes, and then the ninth tee comes off of the dunes and then moves out away from them so uh, those are the holes we worked on today and uh, you know they're pretty exciting I think they add a nice nice dimension you get a nice view of Lake Michigan uh, we don't interfere with anybody that's on the beach or at the park so it's gonna work out nice when you talk about golf being a worldwide sport I know you're a big proponent of it and, and you'd like to see it in the Olympics and that could happen possibly in Chicago in 2016 what do you think about the worldwide interest in the game well the, the, the game has exploded around the world and uh, you know we're doing 90 percent of our work outside the United States and maybe, maybe more than 95%, 90% of our work. But uh, we're doing an awful lot of work in Russia. We're doing an awful lot of work in China, a lot of work in Korea, uh, actually a lot of work in South Africa. Uh, there's a lot of places in the world that uh, uh, the game is growing. And, and if, if golf does become an Olympic sport, which, of course, it'll be decided in Copenhagen in, uh, in, in October. Uh, and I was in China, as I said, two weeks ago. Their plan is that they will build, uh, uh, fifth, uh, what was it, 1,400 uh, public facilities in the next five years. I mean, China will do what they try to do in the Olympics here. You know, they develop golfers, and that'll take time. But 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 you know they'll they'll they'll, they'll do that. Uh, but they'll get government funding from all, all these other places. It probably won't affect us a lot here in the United States. But the game, the growth of the game around the world will be tremendous. And I think that's that's been my goal is to continue to see this game grow and see it grow around the world and become. You know, it's a global game now, but become more of a global game. I'd be remiss if I didn't ask you a question about your playing career and. What are some of the guys out there that you, was there anything that you feared on the golf course when you were playing? Was there, was it a course, a hole, an individual? What were the things well, that, the, uh, the that you, the only, mindset was like? Well, the only thing I, person I could fear was me because there isn't anybody else I can control. Mm -hmm. You know, I couldn't control Palmer or Player or Watson or Trevino or any of those guys. They all had their own game. And all I could do is if I, if I played well, uh, and, and, and put myself in contention, then I had a chance to win. If I didn't, put, didn't do that, it didn't make any difference what, what, what they did. So uh, all I had to do was go out and play myself. I had to prepare myself for every golf course. And, you know, I hear guys today say, oh, that golf course doesn't suit my game. Well, that's the biggest bunch of you know what. And, and so to me, that's a golfer's job is to learn how to adjust his game to whatever the conditions are and what the golf courses are. And so that's, you know, that's what I took pride in all my life and being able to go out and prepare properly for a tournament, get myself where I thought I had a chance to win and, 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 and go out and try to do the best I could. Yeah. Well, still my favorite tape to watch is the 86 Masters. Uh, I can't see it enough. Well, it, it might be one of my favorites too, Dave. <laughs> Great, Jack. Thanks, Thanks so much. My Congratulations. Pleasure. Thank you. Nice to talk to you.